Additionally, we have exempted first-time mortgage holders from payment on stamp duty, and in addition to a range of incentives for developers who build units under the affordable housing program. Further, and on digitizing our, our economy, in April of 2013, during my first few months as president, I directed the National Treasury to conduct a detailed survey of all chargeable government services to ascertain how many of these services were paid through digital means. The survey found that over a third of all payments to government were cash-based, presenting a high opportunity for leakage and abuse of the system. In one case, 60% of revenues were spent on making collections. By launching the e-citizen platform in August of 2014, 350 government services have now been migrated to the e-citizen platform. And in the seven years since its inception, the e-citizen has served a total of 27.2 million unique customers and collected over Kenya shillings 87.1 billion in revenues. Fellow Kenyans, our forefathers' quest for a just and fair nation for all will only be truly realized when we have every single service delivered through a transparent and accountable channel. Therefore, digitization is an important part of our endeavor to improve delivery of government services. Digitization aims to eliminate the duplication of efforts in data collection, processing, storage, and production of identification documents, which has been a feature of government operations since the dawn of our republic. Our policy interventions will also enhance the security of the current ID card through the implementation of a microchip electronic identity card that mitigates against emerging security threats such as identity theft, fraud in financial transactions, and the creation of false identities that are utilized in terrorism and other major crimes. This improved identity card will also be used as a secure travel document within the East African region. To those of you, my friends, who are used to analog systems in order to facilitate corruption, I tell you that the end is nigh, notwithstanding how many court orders you procure, he tafika muishu. To all Kenyans, for us to achieve most of these things under the COVID restrictions, I want to thank you. Without your civic responsibility, innovation, and resilience, none of this would have been made possible.